you very much indeed. It's funny, isn't it? We've got, we've got quite a nice day. It's here, a lovely day it? here. Beautiful. Scotland, snow and all the rest of it. I don't fancy it up there, do you, Tom? I, well, I love the country, but I don't fancy the weather we're getting in <laughs> Boston. No, you're absolutely right. <laughs> Thank you very much, Graham, and uh, welcome along. Just after one o'clock, Tony Blackman here on Radio 2 with another edition of Pick of the Pops. Well, once again, I've got two amazing charts for you, the first one of which will take you back 47 years to 1964, then move on 14 years to some great sounds from 1978. Now, along with the climbers, you'll be hearing artists including the wonderful Manfred Mann, Roy Orbison. The Dave Clark Five, I've also got Rod Stewart and Bob Marley and the Whalers and the Singing Teeth, the Bee Gees. But first of all, let's go back to 1964 with the first of the climbers. Also a new entry, number 39. Peter and Gordon, a world without love. I don't care what they say, I won't stay in a world without love. Peter and Gordon. I don't care what they say, I won't stay in a world without love. A world without love. It will be number one in six weeks' time for two weeks, also top the American charts for one week. Very special year for me, this one, 1964. It was when I started broadcasting. But I've sort of apologized for that, so we're all friends now, aren't we? At number 38 is Doris Day. Oh, well, I'd love to. Make love. I've always had a crush on Doris Day, I tell you. I, I love her. I used to go with my dad to see all her movies, and that was uh, no exception, that one. Move Over Darling, a uh, title song from uh, the movie that she starred in, of course, at number 38. What do you say we have one more climber, then go to the top 20, shall we? At number 29, here are the Apple Jacks, and tell me when here at Pick of the Pots. So if you want my love, won't you tell me? The Apple Jacks are number 29. Tell me, tell me where. I hope you had a terrific week. Thank you for tuning in. Tony Blackman here, BBC Radio 2. Pick of the Pops. It's the weekend, in the 12th of March, 1964. Here comes the top 20. Live this weekend, where the action is. Pick of the Pops with Tony Blackburn. And at number 20, all together now. A shorter version was uh, used as a theme to the 60s pop show Ready Steady Go, if you remember. Man from Man there at number 20, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, Saturday afternoon. And at number 19, I love this sound from the Ronettes, the Phil Spector Wall of Sound. And baby, I love you. an exciting sound, isn't it? The Ronettes there and Baby I Love You at number 19. The girls began their professional careers as a dance troupe, calling themselves the Dolly Sisters. I think the Ronettes sounds better, don't you? <laughs> and at number 18, a guy who spent most of his time jumping up and down in the air. Freddie and the Dreamers and Over You. Over You. The dream is over you at number 18. Their fourth UK top 20 hit, but the first not to make the top 10. Remember this golden classic. At number 17, here comes Brenda Lee as usual. Tony Blackburn, BBC Radio 2. Brenda Lee, as usual, at number 17. Amazing to think Brenda's opening act when she uh, toured the UK in the early 60s with the Beatles. Wow. At number 16, here's one of my favorites, Gene Pitney. A 
that's the title from Gene Pitney at number 16, written by Mick Jagger and Keith Richards, originally uh, called My Only Girl, first recorded by George Bean, who once had a group called The Rudders. <laughs> I knew his brother, Coffee. Here's Roy Orbison at number 15 and born on the wind. Take the pops on BBC Radio 2. That's the big O, Roy Orbison there, and Born on the Wind at number 15, and at number 14, an American DJ. We always introduced him as Gentleman Jim, Jim Reeves, at number 14, I love you, because I, I love you for a hundred thousand reasons, but most of all. Released just a few months before he was killed in a plane crash, actually, Jim Reeves. And I love you because at number 14, Tony Blackman here with Pick of the Pots. And at number 13, here's Dusty Springfield with a follow-up to the debut solo hit single, I Only Want to Be With You. It's called uh, Stay A While. Number 13, Dusty Springfield, stay a while. Uh, number 12, here he is, the Mersey sound of Jerry and the Pacemakers. Jerry and the Pacemakers, I am the one. He read that himself, actually. Uh, number 12 and a number 11, a song that started out its life on the B-side uh, of a Roy Orbison 1961 hit called Cry. Here's Brown pulling the treble. It was in Candyman at number 11. Candyman! Oh, don't you just love these hits? Brown pulling the treble. It was in Candyman. Candy. Weekending the 12th of March, 1964. Uh, Stanley, did you know that... Uh... Barry Manilow begins a new series of programmes here on BBC Radio 2. Oh,